Hello, this is Dr. Liu at Li Tai. Ginger is one of the most popular ingredients used in the Chinese traditional medicine, and also it's, it's the most used spice in the Chinese cuisine because of its aroma and the spicy taste. Ginger is the major chemical it brings the spicy taste of the ginger, medicinal benefits including anti-inflammation, anti-tumor, reduce pain. And the modern research proves ginger can be used to help treat nausea and vomiting after the chemotherapy or during the pregnancy. An article published on the John Hopkins Medicine they recommend the ginger tea to help comfort during the pregnancy. And other promising research proves that ginger can be used to treat arthritis pain, reduce cholesterol, and reduce the blood pressure. Even there are more clinical data needed to prove its efficacy, but because of its low side effect, it is worse to try the ginger to help reduce the symptoms. So today I'm showing you the four easy ways to extract uh, ginger. The first one is uh, the ginger tea. It's, uh, you use the fresh ginger or ginger bag to make a ginger tea. The second one is the ginger vinegar. And uh, the third one is a ginger tincture. And the last one is a ginger hydrosome made by steam distillation. To make a ginger tea is easy, all you need is a fresh ginger or a ginger tea bag. A fresh ginger, you peel the skin off and slice it and put a one big piece into the cup and pour the hot water in. And let it simmer for a couple minutes. Longer has a stronger flavor because the ginger roll, it can be uh, go into the water. The problem with ginger raw is uh, it doesn't dissolve in water. So you may have uh, a bit of a spicy flavor in your tea, but it won't be very strong. So you can also add uh, the flavored uh, honey. I'm using the lavender infused honey. So the second one we talk about is making the ginger vinegar. You can use the apple cider vinegar. I use uh, the, the brown color, this is a rice vinegar. Uh, the ratio is uh, 50 gram of the fresh ginger in this two cup full of uh, with, uh, vinegar. The first step is to uh, slice the 50 gram of the, of the ginger and put in the cup and uh, fill it with uh, the vinegar. Because the vinegar's uh, acidity, the ginger has a little bit higher solubility in the vinegar compared with uh, water. You may have a stronger spicy taste in the vinegar compared with uh, tea. The third way is to make a ginger tincture. Actually, ginger tincture is one of the best way to extract the, the ginger oil out of the ginger because ginger oil has Pretty good solubility in alcohol, uh, way better than the water. So that's why I recommend you use the 60% alcohol. A little bit higher than the vodka, uh, make uh, the ginger oil easily dissolved or more ginger oil dissolved in the tincture. And also because there are water, 40% water from uh, this alcohol. So some of the water soluble compounds can also go into the tincture. The last one I want to talk about is the ginger hydrosol made by steam distillation. So you can see the cloudy of uh, this uh, ginger hydrosol because it contains the chemical name the uh, Zinjinjibri. This is the major chemical within the ginger essential oil. It's made through the distillation. Um, the chemical becomes different between the hydrosol and the last three ways. So we were talking about ginger oil, 
but that is not volatile so it wouldn't go into the ginger essential oil or hydrosol then Jamboree has a good anti-inflammation, antibacteria, simple ginger flavor. So the ginger hydrosol is very good for the facial cleaning, the hair protection, the cleaning, and it can be routinely used for your everyday skincare. So if you love the ginger flavor and the ginger hydrosol is the one, I highly recommend you to try to do your the routine skincare and hair care. So okay, today I introduce you the four ways you can use the ginger at home, the ginger tea, vinegar, tincture, and the ginger hydrosol. So what is the other ways you use? Please leave as a comments. And thank you for watching. Please like the video, subscribe to the channel. See you next time.